Well, okay, time for yet another unboxing today because this is very, very exciting. And this is even speaking to someone who's not like a Star Wars fan on any level. Just like a Simon fan. Yep, that's right. Today we're unboxing, and I'll try and demonstrate, the Star Wars Episode One Simon Space Battle game. I almost couldn't read that for a minute. Um, this came out in 1999, a full year before Simon 2, actually. Um, I can flip it over with one hand. Careful, it is old after all. I don't know why the box is upside down. Like it's normally not printed that way. Let me try it again. Uh... This is going to be interesting. I've heard mixed things about this thing, and I've heard it's really, really fun at the exact same time. So, this is going to be fun, and again, very interesting at the exact same time. So, let me put the camera down, which is again, literally just my iPad because of Minaj. Um, wait, is it open box? I think it might just be open box. Oh, wait. Let me check. Um, no, it's that tape on the other side. Careful. I am going to be saving the box, by the way. Yeah. It's very, very big, apparently. I'm gonna take the uh, inserts out and get the manual out as well. Holy frick, is this thing enormous. Oh, God. Oh, my God, it's huge! Because, like, videos on YouTube make it look so much smaller. Uh, careful. Actually, no, I don't care about the inserts. So, let me just tear it apart. I'm just gonna keep the old, the, uh, the outer box. Not the inner box. Yeah, it folds up. That's actually really cool. Not gonna lie, this is really epic. Oh my god. Um, how do I open it back up again, though? Oh, just... It just latches on there, you can undo it. Um, throw the box over there. Place it in front of here for you guys to see. While I read the manual. Holy frick. And also, the buttons are... I wasn't expecting it to be, like, this small. Um, and the LEDs, I think, are on... Uh, let me... I think they're on the Starship things, whatever. I don't really care about Star Wars. Um, I can already see it says Star Wars Episode One Simon. Oh, man, this is really, really cool. Like, look at all the detail that went into this thing, too. Like, like all the... Different parts of the design. This is really cool. Oh my god. Um, put the camera back down again, which is, again, there's my, my, uh, why did I almost say my laptop? My iPad. Um, oh, holding the manual backwards. Um, oh crap. I forgot. I got, um, two AA batteries ready instead of three. My bad. I am a complete nage. Which is no surprise anymore. I can typically be a complete nage. Thankfully, I just need one more battery. Um, I have no idea. I'm going to do just regular Simon. I'll look at the manual later because I don't want to keep you guys waiting. So, um... Okay. Let's see. Battery compartment is on the bottom. Wait, does it not come with feet? Because it has, like, space for feet. Does it not come with the feet? I am so confused. Never seen this one in person before, so I wouldn't know. Let me double check. I don't think it came with feet, though. I don't think it's supposed to, I guess? I don't see any feet. I'm very confused. Yeah, it didn't come with feet, but it has, like, spaces where, where there would be rubber feet to, to, like, put in the bottom. I'm stalling. I'm sorry. Um... Again, released in 1999, one year before Simon 2. I will dedicate a demo video to this one as well, and I will arrange it in proper chronological order, which means before Travel Simon, uh, no, before Simon 2, and Simon, and Pockets, no, Travel Simon 2 has to do. Anyway, let's see how this works. I am very, very curious. I don't know how loud it is, though, for the record. Um, thankfully, there's no corrosion. That would have been a terrible, terrible nightmare if it had corrosion, because I am sick and tired of corrosion. Um, let's see. 
This is gonna be like a hard thing to put up, like to capture on on camera as well, because it is enormous. Oh my god. This thing is almost gargantuan. Holy frick. Let me go put my screwdriver back. I don't need it anymore. Put it right next to my bitty boomers, which are those awesome Bluetooth speakers that are compact and are, well, awesome. Let me toss the box over where the air boxes are as well, because I want to preserve this box as best I possibly can. Incoming. There we go. Let me show you guys what the, what the uh, game unit looks like when it's folded up. I think I'm going to show it to you when it was like uh, folded out. Um, this thing looks pretty cool. Not going to lie. It looks really epic. Oh my god. It's the exact same thing on both sides. And it folds out. Hopefully I can not break it. Crap. Do it with both hands. Holy frick. This thing is epic. Um... Let me find the power button if there, like, is a specific location for it. Um, or is there, is there a power switch? I'm so confused. Um, I don't see anything. Oh, wait, yes I do. Wait, no, no, no. That was the screw, I'm a complete nosh. Um, where is the, is it like, is there like a power button or something? I'm so confused. Dude, seriously, is there like a power switch or something? I'm not seeing anything. This is not good. I have no idea how to power this thing on. Oh my god. Like, I would look at the manual, but that wastes everyone's time, so I don't want to do that. Come on, but how do I turn this thing on? This is very confusing. I don't know if it's working, I guess. I'll keep looking. Yeah, I'm not seeing the power switch. I'm looking everywhere, but I don't see anything to power it on. Let me look at the manual. I mean, I don't want to waste your time, anyone's time, but I guess I should look at the manual for like, 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 Let's see. Um, oh man, this is so confusing. Holy frick. Um, uh, so, power is assigned to A. If I can just find A. This is going to be a thing. Oh, wait. I think I know where it is. I think I know where it is. Let me try this again. Crap. I think it's in the corner somewhere. There we go. Okay. There we go. Sorry about that. I think I have to face it this way, though. Star Wars, Simon. Select game. Star Wars, Simon. Star Wars, challenge, Simon. Star Wars, counter Are they all the Simon. same color? That's so Star confusing. Wars, ultimate. Star Wars, Simon. Select level. Level one. Le level one. Let's try it. The force? Yes? No? I don't know what that means. I'll just go with no. No? Um. Crap. I didn't see that. I hit. Try again? Yes? No? Last? Longest? Ah. Notification getting in the way because I'm on Twitter. I hit. Try again. Try again? Yes? No? Last? Very loud. Crap. I'm hit. The speaker sounds kind yes, of no. 
Hello? Kind of bad in some instances. Let me try that again, though. Yeah, it sounds like it's trying to do it. Like it's straining to try and do like all the notes. Try and practice practice this off camera, I guess. Try again. Yes. No. Last. Longest. I mean, it's fine. A lot of people seem to hate it. Like, I don't know why, but a lot of people seem to hate it. Like, I'm no Star Wars fan. I was actually against getting this one at first, and I mean, it's fine. Ah. Like, it's a fine collector's item. Don't get me wrong. I'm just like not a Star Wars fan. Because, like, it looks cool when you fold it up. Um, if I can show it on camera, I think it says... Yeah, it says, a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. That's really cool. That is actually really cool. It says so on the other side, though. I'm really confused. May the 4th... Okay, that is really cool. I'm no Star Wars fan, but that is really cool. Oh, God. I'm gonna mess around with this for a while, off camera. I will make a demo video of it. It will be... I will arrange it so it's properly adjusted in the timeline before Simon 2 and Simon Travel Edition 2002. But yeah, I'm going to have a lot of fun with this thing. I can definitely tell. And again, speaking of someone who's like not even a Star Wars fan. Holy frick. But uh, yeah, I thought I'd make this little video because this just came in the mail today. Not even like too long ago. And I was really excited to share it with you guys. Oh, there goes my light. And that all that leaves is Super Simon 2003. And I know people are going to say, are you going to get uh, Simon Classic 2015? No, there is no point. Because Simon Classic 2020 is so much better. I mean, I would get it for the sake of the retrospective, but at the same time, I, I kind of can't and don't want to. Can't because it's out of print, and if you, have to, if you want to get one, like, secondhand, you will have to potentially deal with, like, a broken speaker or sound chip. It's very annoying, and I'm not going to risk that. And I don't want to because, again, well, Classic 2020 is so much better. But, uh, yeah. Thought I'd show this off. And again, demo video will be coming out at some point. Next up in the Simon Retrospective is going to be the Simon Micro Series, also known as one of the greatest things ever constructed. So I will see you guys then. Earthworm Joe 94, signing out.